It's about that time for me to say goodbye. No, not to you guys. <laughs> Sorry. To me to freak you out. Not to you guys. Uh, to the hair. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's time to say goodbye to the twist for the summer. I surround my soul with the positivity. That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see. Yeah. These days I don't worry about much. I think we should have some more fun. I still dream about the days when we were young. I'll take a hit and still finish and I won. What's up, everybody? It's your girl TJ. I'm back with another video talks with TJ, aka TJ Two Shoes Chains. This will be a little bit different, right? Cause I'm not really unboxing anything. Well, I might, who knows? I'm sure I have something that's in the mail. We won't discuss that, okay? I'm sure I have stuff in the mail. But in terms of this video, hey, first off, brand new. Uh, this is not my normal content, but if you choose to subscribe, really appreciate it. Uh, hit the like button. Also, even if you exit the video, like right now. <laughs> and two sisters crew, listen, I expect you all to just be here and, you know, us to vibe together. Uh, yeah, it's, it's time to take the twist out. You guys know the twists have been amazing. Extremely low maintenance. Your girl has the ability to be lazy as ever, okay? With twist rings, it's really low maintenance. You don't have to do a whole lot. It holds up great via workouts. And even just when it's hot, like I'm really a big fan about that. But the weather has finally broken. It feels like fall, which means I am ready to have my straight hair back. Some of you probably don't even remember what I look like with straight hair depending on when you subscribe to my channel because I really have gone through 14 weeks uh with just a break in between to wash condition and then get ready to do like the next set of twists so most of the summer my hair has been in twists I think there was like a two-week period where it wasn't in twists I got twists back in like April when we first shut down went through two weeks of having my hair straight went right back to twist washed it took it down took it down washed it went right back to these twists so now I'll be twist free for a minute and I'm actually really excited to be able to run my own hands through my hair. Now, it is much more maintenance, right? When your hair is straight. Okay, my hair is all natural, first off. There's no perm. There's no nothing in my hair. Uh, it's all natural. So for those who don't know what that means, yeah, it's, it's upkeep, certainly. I have really, really thick hair. I'm trying to grow it out, and I have really thick hair. So yeah, it's a lot to maintain, but... In the end, I love my hair. Like it doesn't, I don't have to put a whole lot of anything in terms of product in it. And that's what I love. Okay. That also keeps it pretty low cost. People are like, well, how would you wear your hair in its actual curly state? Understand this to wear a hair like that, it takes so much more time, which I first off don't have and I'm not willing to dedicate to it. Also, it takes a lot of product. So I'm not going to spend more money and more time. That just doesn't seem like a good ROI for me, at least. So I'll be rocking my straight hair. I'll try to rock my bun more because I don't rock it enough. I'll rock it like one or two days and then I'm like, all right, bet, time to wash it. So I'll try to do that. Um, so stay tuned. Uh, I might show you the different stages that I end up going through or partly when it comes to doing my hair. But yeah, the twists are coming down, being taken out. And then that means I have to take my hair down, which is braided under this out and then I have to uh, comb and brush that out and then I have to wash and then deep condition and then blow dry and then get it trimmed then straighten my hair okay it's a whole workout it's a whole process but I'll give you a little little bit of an inside look all right so we'll just we'll just cut away from here and I will see you soon straight for at least 14 weeks uh which is a long time but again the twists are amazing for summer they're low maintenance i never have to worry about sweat i can go work out uh be out in the hot weather and it's just it's not a concern at all but weather has finally broken it feels like fall as it should now bless up best season of the year to me at least okay for dress uh, activities and everything. Okay. Fall also means football. So I'm very, very excited about that. Uh, it takes quite a bit. I already warned you. It takes quite a bit to, uh, get my hair from just its natural curly state to straight. But once it's done, listen, worth it. Absolutely worth it. So you guys can see now my hair has grown quite a bit. I mean, I, I think it was great 
having that 14 weeks, there was a break in between, right? But essentially 14 weeks of my hair being in twists. So there's no manipulation of my actual hair. Uh, there's no heat put on it, no anything. And I, I think it's grown. Uh, I used to have pretty deep layers and those are grown out a lot. So uh, goal is to get it to go, you know, just grow a little bit more and then stop because to blow dry, to straighten. Listen, if you're asking me, oh, what was the workout today? Listen, doing this hair, that was the workout today. There's no additional workout. That was the workout today. So I am good to go, which means I can go about uh, the rest of my day. So when you guys are viewing this, it's Saturday. So I kind of had to vlog this over Thursday and then into Friday because right before I straightened my hair after I blow dry, I had to go get a trim as stated. So I did that. Um, let me go ahead and I'll just show you this quick unboxing, right? It's that time of year. I like to call it, right? Spooky season. Um, I love it, not necessarily for dressing up, but I love horror movies. So Netflix actually doesn't have tons of horror movies. They have better horror TV shows right now. So I was trying to look for a horror movie I really wanted to get into, but I couldn't find one. I'm really upset Sinister is no longer on there. I don't think The Conjuring is on there either. So uh, at the moment, I actually just started binge watching Slasher. So season one and then season two is on. Season three is okay. I'm a really big fan of season one though. But I picked up a shirt from the Dirt Label. So if you don't know who they are, they are a Detroit-based company. So you guys already know, 313. That is literally still the area code for my phone number. And they did a special edition for this Halloween season. So they did, they, they do a, a variation of bears, right? So um, different bears. And they did a Chucky bear. So it was imperative that I picked up a Chucky bear. So here you guys go, Chucky Bear shirt. I'm ready for spooky season. And yes, um, when it comes to child's play, this is absolutely one of my favorite horror movies, the entire, just the, the series. And I'm somebody that two to me, two is better than one. I actually still like three. I know a lot of people don't like three. Cult of Chucky was hilarious <laughs> when they were in the uh, asylum. But so here we go, looks amazing. So. Uh, I know they're doing limited runs of this, so they have this in gray, they have it in black, and then they have a hoodie as well. Uh, so I think their shirt was $40 total. So guys, absolutely, you know, take a look at it. It's got so many details. I mean, it's got the good guy, shoes on, it's got the good guy, it's got everything. Except instead of Chucky being Chucky, you know, he's a bear. <laughs> um, so glad I picked this up from Dirt Label. I've been meaning to get, you know, items from them, just dragging my feet. Uh, I did pick up some fall essential items that I needed, so I don't know if I ever mentioned, but I have a black leather jacket. You guys may see me style it in certain flat lays. Fun fact, which you didn't know, it's actually torn along the outer back part on the sleeves. When I moved about a year ago, I'm not sure what happened, but I think it tore in the move or a hanger caught onto it or something. So both of them are like that, which means, of course, I couldn't really wear it out <laughs> and it looked presentable, but I was able to find a guest uh, faux leather jacket on eBay, so that is on the way. And then I also picked up a very unique Fear of God piece, like super unique. But I got a lot to get, I got a lot to do in my day, um, but the hair is done. So that it was the big thing out of the way. Um, got the cleanup done. So apartment is back, straight, set, no chaos, which means I can, uh, I probably need to go film other things. I always have a lot going on. I love how YouTube wanted to remind me that I only uploaded 25 videos in September and they said that's lower than what you normally do. Wow. So are you telling me I fell off or what? 25? This is not my full-time job. I have a job. I'm going to get to that and then get to just enjoying the weekend. So hopefully you guys are doing that. Please let me know if you want after any releases this weekend. And oh yes, by the way, you guys should check in to I'm Simply Be on Sunday. Four o'clock Eastern Standard Time, okay? If you don't know who she is, amazing woman, amazing presence in this sneaker community. Um, you've probably seen her all over sneakers app, uh, as well as she did a special unboxing of the um, off or not the Jordan 4 uh, Union. And then she, she, when it comes to dunks, like if I have a dunk question, I'm just gonna go to her, okay? So I'll be featured on her channel this Sunday, 4 p.m. I made sure it's after the Colts game. So 4 p.m. You guys can check it out. It's going to be on IG. So at I'm Simply B. Drop on by. Uh, leave any you know questions you guys have. We'll try to get to those as best as we can. But as always, act your age, not your shoe size. Peace out.